Welcome to this flute cast on the uh, Miyako Bushi scale. That's what I was playing there. And it's a scale that for most people evokes the feeling of an Asian culture. And it's uh, very easy to play on these instruments. We're going to um, do this in the way we do uh, all these scales. We'll look at each of the individual notes, um, put the scale together, and then uh, do a little bit on uh, how to make your own melody in this scale. So let's begin with uh, all holes closed. And uh, from there, the first three notes are very familiar. You're going to go to two holes open and then one more hole open. So it sounds like... These fingerings work on most contemporary Native American flutes. I'm showing you the fingerings that are kind of standard for most of the flutes that are made today. And when we build up these scales, we'll practice just those initial intervals, and we'll add one more interval, one more note at a time as we work our way up the scale. So if I were learning the scale for the first time, I would just stay in that space of those first two or three notes. Even include some leaps, come across multiple notes, And then add one more note. The next note up might be familiar, it might not. We're just going to switch the third and the fourth holes, just like that. And we'll get this new note. I'm going fairly quickly here, but if you're working with the scale for the first time, you're going to go nice and slow. Maybe work with that a couple of minutes a day for a week, and you will build up facility getting faster and faster. I'm going fairly fast here. The idea is not, of course, to do it by rote, but to really add expressiveness to our scales. Uh, we're not here just to play the scales. We're here to uh, put our feeling and our emotion into this. note, which is the top note, the octave note. So we've got one, two, three, four notes, plus the octave. You might think that's a, a four-note scale, of course, we don't count the octave because it's a, a duplicated note. But there's actually a fifth note. And we put that fifth note, because we can't easily get it in the low register, we put it into the second register. The next note up, okay, which adds our fifth note, is a, an unusual note, but a note that works on almost all Native American flutes, which is simply to close all the fingers except the top hole, right, except the nearest our breath, and if you play it from the top note, that's our octave note, we'll then put all fingers down except the top finger. And it's a kind of a high tension note. I absolutely love this. Um, it's a uh, it's very reliable and it's very easy to play just by putting your fingers down. If we go from the bottom note in the scale, and that's the whole scale that's easily achievable on most instruments. Miyako Bushi. I'll do it with adding some leaps rather than going up and down the scale as we would do in a scale song. Look at the scale song video on how to take that scale and make it musical just by playing the scale. But if you want to take some leaps, I'm going to 
to show you one more note that's achievable on this flute and a small percentage of Native American flutes. It's this note in the second register. So I'm cracking the top finger and I'm picking up my bottom two fingers. On this flute and a few other Native American flutes, you can reach this note. So if you find a flute that works, great. If not, a note's not really needed. Um, One more thing I'd like to suggest as you're improvising melodies, um, most of our melodies that we play in these instruments, we resolve them. Uh, the song has a, a melodic line and it goes up. If it starts on the bottom note, it goes and travels and then comes back down and usually ends on that bottom note. And that's, that's uh, melodically is resolving the song. And it makes you feel, ah, there's completion. Uh, in this, uh, in this scale, in the Miyakobushi scale, I'll often, I won't resolve it. I'll end on sort of a question mark. So my melody might begin on the bottom note and end somewhere else. And just leave it there. So that's the Miyako Bushi scale. I hope you can put that to good use.